Hi Brad from WordPressSites.net. Uh, my latest blog post, how to set up and use Scribe SEO plugin for WordPress. It's a WordPress SEO uh, plugin and uh, SEO software designed by the owner of uh, Copy Blogger Media, who also own the Studio Press themes and the Genesis framework. So I've just installed this today for a client of mine, and uh, it's quite interesting. It's it's got some really good SEO secrets that. Uh, that I sort of knew about before, but didn't really know how to uh, to apply it to my own SEO. So uh, I'm glad I got the chance to install and use this plugin today, and I've written a full blog post on it. So it's quite interesting. So um, if you're going to take a trial, they offer a 30-day free trial. So I think it's certainly worth having a look at if you're uh, if you're an internet marketer or a uh, blogger who writes with regular blog posts and looking for more search engine traffic so I'll just show you how to set it up it's pretty straightforward here's the scribe settings it's just a matter of putting in your API key which you'll get when you sign up um, allow the scribe plugin to choose a supported tool based on the configuration well I'm currently using the Genesis to that theme for this client so it's made by the same owner so it fits perfectly with uh, with this plugin, so it's just a matter of uh, entering the API keyword there, security method, it's not an SSL, uh, and clicking save, and that's that's the settings. Every, each time you go into your blog post, you'll see these options over on the right hand side scribe keyword research, scribe content optimizer, and also got scribe link building. So it, it handles external links, internal links, and social media links, which is, which is pretty good. It's, um, it's quite impressive actually um, and it's just a matter of clicking these buttons and, uh, and it will give you all the information on the keywords and the suggestions so I won't click them because every time I click them I, uh, you only get a certain amount of valuations per month depending on which you're planning to use and so uh, I haven't added much content I've just put in, in some information about the author so I'm waiting for the author to uh, to write the content for this post and then I'll fully op op optimize it so I'll, I'll write another post and also make another video once I've fully optimized it and we'll see how well it does in the search results but, but I'm very confident based on this blog post and the keywords that we've got that uh, this plugin will help us to achieve a lot. Just going back to my blog post now, I've just written a few notes here, a few tips. Uh, I, I think the best way to learn SEO is to use a method that you're confident in. And if, whether you want to use a tool like SEO Press or you want to use Scribe, it's a great way for beginners and intermediates to learn SEO. And, and, and the best way to, to, to learn it is to put it into practice rather than try to read a lot of, and, and gather a lot of information. I think. Uh, if you're writing blog posts, especially every day, it's it's a great uh, it's a great way to learn quickly the basic fundamentals of SEO is, is by using these tools and, and putting them into practice every day. Scribe have produced uh, quite a few videos. Here's here's what a link on my site to the uh, WordPress <coughs> the WordPress demo video. So it gives a good description of how to use Scribe. Um, I've already talked about the activation. So, so when you click on those buttons I showed you before in the WordPress dashboard, you'll see all the information that comes up here. We've only scored 39% because we haven't added the content yet. We've, we've only put some information on the author. So it'll give you all the information there, what you need to do to increase your SEO. So you get an SEO score, you get a keyword analysis, you get change keywords, alternative keywords. It advises you on tags. It advises you on SERP, which is your search engine results page, and it's got some really good tips with SEO best practices. So uh, there's some really good information in there about SEO, and uh, and these guys certainly know what, what they're doing when it comes to SEO. It shows you an example here what your uh, what your what your result may look like in the search engine results page. So this is really important as well. And, and the information that it gives you on be best practices, I've only put a bit in here, I haven't put the whole lot because it's, uh, you really need to take it for a test drive if you want to find out all the secrets that this plugin offers. Just a quick tip before I go, um, social media links and uh, incoming links and page rank, Google, Google deleted page rank from Webmaster, Webmaster Tools in 2009, so it's only one, one out of 200 different factors Google considers for search engine results. So.